lot. More, <laughs> more. More bubbles, more bubbles, let's go. Gregor. Hey, Dad. What, what happened at six o'clock? I know, uh, I'm sorry, it's just the light outside. <laughs> Late summer, incredible. And I just, uh... Got distracted, missed dinner. Yeah, uh... Dad, I'm sorry. When I say six o'clock, I don't care how great the light is, you're home. Do you understand me? Just clean it up. Trust me, I know it. Thanks for the lift. Okay, you need a lift tonight? No, no, I can, uh, I can make it home. I'll, I'll be on time, time tonight, okay? Good. Good luck today, sport. Is that the sound of your heart pounding? No, wait, it's mine. Proof that summer is so overrated. <laughs> Back at this dump, Four more years. Four long years. Look at this place. It's a zoo in here. Oh, look. There's one of the monkeys now. Good morning, students, and welcome to Degrassi. If you're a new student and haven't received your new homeroom number yet, please see Mrs. Smith in the main office immediately. Is Degrassi a high school and a blind school this year? Sorry, man, I'm lost. Buy a map. Already got one. I'm not blind. Just, uh... Hey, boys. Who's the new guy? Directionally challenged. Hey, cutie. At my lab. Here, I'll, I'll show you. Here, I'll show you. <laughs> Closing down the high school was a last-minute board decision, meaning we are not fully prepared for the influx of students. Will there be a separate student council? Separate video announcements? What about the grapevine? Okay, one question at a time. In the short term, Degrassi's gonna be a very crowded place. The council and Mr. Small Madison price to pay. Older women, younger men, very hot. But we'll make it Older women, JT we'll York, very not. As we work together. Take a seat. You may even have to share lockers. See me after class. We're gonna be covering Pontypool Changes Everything by Tony Burgess. Adding grades nine to 12 is a great opportunity for Degrassi and for you guys. I taught you uh, MI for the past two years. <laughs> Get me for another four. Late night last night, huh, Craig? Uh, very, uh, very late night, sir. I kept, kept waking up in anticipation of, well, this exact moment, <laughs> sir. Yeah, we'll save the Z's for home, okay? Don't forget to pick up your textbooks in the gym, and even though today is a half day, tomorrow is not. Okay, and every second week, we'll take out lunches, uh, old school stuff. Whatever you say, Rumi. I can't believe you guys volunteered to share. 
that's just her way of giving something back to Degrassi, that's all. Yeah, or of destroying your friendship. Oh, slow down. And how soon till we tell them we told them so? Now, I get the top shelf, all right? Why? We said I got it. No, I get the top shelf because I'm taller. Yeah, by like a millimeter. No, check this out. Ready? Look. See? Way tall. Paige, your hair is fine. Fine. I have a mullet. What's a mullet? That. Hairstyle of the trailer dwellers in fashion and hair. So get it fixed. Yeah, but that'll cost about 80 bucks. I have 50 put away, but my evil parents are insisting I clean out the garage for the rest. Hello, child labor. You know, there are laws against child labor. OK, thanks, Mr. News at Five. Cute. Very. I tried to range. Guys, hey, I tried to call you and I got back. How was your summer? Anyway, about my hair. Give him time. I'm sure we'll, you know. What, forgive and forget? Right. I know, but summer's over, I'm back from camp, and now you won't ever get away from me. Okay, say... Bad donkey breath. Bad donkey breath. Let me take yours. Who, me? I'll break the camera. <laughs> Remember how to use it? Yeah. One hand there. Mommy, wanna come? Just, um, tell her I miss her, okay? Hey, you can't tell your dad about us meeting, all right? I promise. Always, always. Angela! Love you, kid. Angela, honey, who is that? My brother. Okay, I give you the Isaac system. The what? Okay, you want an older woman? The system will determine your best match. Meet Terry McGregor. <sighs> Guys, your uh, dedication to grade eight is impressive, but uh, go home already. Can we just finish this first? Five minutes. Terry's not really my type. She's older, pretty, and breathing. Exactly your type. No, I need more of a challenge. Someone like... Oh, Lordy. But you only have like a 0.03% chance of scoring with Paige Michaelchuk. Come to pup. That's a lot of yellow, Angie. But that was Mammy's favorite color, remember? <laughs> yes, I do. Do you think she misses us? Oh, I know she does. Just as much as we miss her. But do you think she likes it up in heaven? Craig said that. Craig said what? Honey, did you see Craig? No, I didn't. I promise. Come on, sweetie. Tell me the truth. Stay right here, OK? Mm -hmm. Craig? Craig! Are you ready to eat? Greg! 
Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm just coming. Wow. <laughs> Roast beef, mashed potatoes, Yorkshire pudding. Your favorite. Yeah, totally. I love roast beef. Remember, remember how mom used to make it? So, how was the first day? Make any friends? Yeah, one guy, Sean. He's cool. That's great. Listen, there was a message on the machine today. For me? No, for me, from Joey Jeremiah. Any thoughts? Any idea why he might be calling? You didn't call him. I... Come on, why would I call Joey? Why would your mother leave a surgeon for a used car salesman, Craig? Or, I mean, the mysteries of the universe are infinite to me. Well, I, I didn't... I didn't call. I promise. I'm not... Um, I'm not... Like mom, okay? So, uh, are you gonna call him back? Now, why would I do that? Okay, my destiny is approaching. Project page has officially begun. Yeah, it'll be over in about two minutes. Oh look, it's gross and grosser. Looks like Grosser wants a word with you. Uh, Paige, may I say that you're looking rather radiant today? May I carry your bag for you? Um, you want to carry my bag? Yeah, I'll carry it home, I'll carry it to school. Your wish is my command. Oh, well, in that case, um, I wish that you'd go back to your girlfriend over there and leave me alone. Now. <sighs> wow. You, great inspiration. The battle has just begun. Paige Michael Chuck will be mine. Okay. And I guess I believe that with a positive attitude and a drive to succeed, we can pretty well achieve anything. At least that's what I tell myself every time I face a challenge. So, that's me. Very illuminating, Ashley. Okay, who's next? Craig Manning. I am Craig Manning. Thank you. Craig, we know your name. Now we want to know about you. All right. Uh, me. In an infinite universe. Yeah, an, an insignificant planet. What are we, one of, one of six billion inhabitants? Big deal. And honestly, if I were to say if I were to disappear, who'd care? <laughs> what would it matter? Uh, a subatomic blip in the temporal fabric of creation. So there you have it, uh, Craig Manning. Very existential, Craig. Okay, Heather Sinclair, come on down. He's in grade nine? Yeah, I saw him coming out of Simpson's home room this morning. Why do the Niners get all the hotties? What do you mean? We have JT. And Toby. Oh. <laughs> Shh. There he is. Where? Emma Nelson, right? You, uh, you babysit Angela Jeremiah. I do? I mean, I do, but... You don't recognize me? Five years ago? Our mothers made us dance. The wedding. Craig is Joey's stepson. Angela's half-brother. Oh. Oh, hi. Hey, anyway, uh, nice to see you again. Craig, wait. I'm babysitting Angela later. My mom's having this big party, and I was wondering if maybe you want to come along? 
I, I wouldn't want to crash. No, you'd be my guest. If you do want to come, meet me up front after school. I'll be there. Thanks. <laughs> He's coming tonight. <laughs> if this car is a lemon, which it is not, I will give you a real lemon and let you squeeze it in my eyes. Sound fair? Yeah. Oh, listen to the man. He knows cars. Uh, would, would you excuse me for just a minute? Uh, why don't you open her up and okay. see how she feels? OK, I'll be with Thank you right, right away. Hello, Albert. You got my message? Sure did. Good. Well, it's about Craig. I know this is really none of my business, but... He's going to butt in anyway. I just wanted to know how is he doing. What's your interest in my son? I just... He's my son, right? Yes, but he's also Angela's brother. Half-brother? What's your point? Angela misses him, OK? And I know he misses her. You and I need to do something. OK, him. you and I need to do nothing except stay away from each other. OK, you're not getting it here, OK? Craig wants to see Angela, and I know he has been seeing her. Just found out myself. He's been doing it on his own time. Look, you and I may hate each other, but do our kids have to? E even if it's just once a month. <laughs> OK, according to the Isaac system, you and Paige are never going to happen. Would that be the same system that stopped you from doing anything about Emma last year? Newsflash told me it doesn't work. Uh, Paige, hold up. OK, I need a restraining order. What? Uh, will you go out with me? All I'm asking for is one date. If we click, then we'll talk commitment. What do you say? <laughs> <laughs> Man, that is classic. What a knob. In time. OK, has my rep fallen to the point where a loser like JT thinks he can ask me out and get away with it? It's hilarious. You should totally do it. Yeah, I mean, Paige and JT on a date? Oh, yeah. Never going to happen, ever. Hmm. Everyone has their price, like, say, 30 bucks, enough to get your hair done. You honestly think? I would go out in public with it for 30 bucks. A light evening with Frodo or an entire day gagging through cobwebs in your parents' garage? Yeah, you know, it, it's about the earwigs. Sharp, pinchers, just... $30 in cash. Fine, but there will be conditions. Big conditions. I'm oh, in. A running with rats. A lying with cats. Is that a frog? Are you kidding? This is a big razor toothed dinosaur with a taste for little girls named Angela. <laughs> what are you guys doing to her? Oh, just feeding her to the dinosaurs. OK, guys, dinner served. Come on. Yeah. Hey, we didn't expect you. I mean, it's only my birthday. Much less important than a blind date. OK, OK, my bad. So, Jeremiah, how was Miss November? She was Miss November. It was from 1973. Ooh, it was like going out with my mother. <laughs> ah, well, you know, women of a certain age do have a special appeal. You can leave now. What, I miss watching you turn gray? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, he's coming home with me after we eat. Craig, hey, what are you doing here? I invited him. It's OK, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, no. Um, can I talk to you for a second? Listen, it's, it's great seeing you. OK, I mean that. But your dad doesn't want you here. Oh, he's, he's fine with this. He knows you're here? Look, I, I don't know why, but he doesn't want you hanging out with me or with Ange. He's made that radically clear. Wait, you talked to him? He came by the dealership this afternoon. Greg, come on. Your dad won't allow it. What do you want me to do? No problem. I get it. Hey, uh, Miss Nelson. Thanks for the hot dog.
I'll go down to my dark room. Are you looking for something? What are you doing? Are you looking for something? What are you doing? What are you Are you looking for something? Ass off for you. Do I get? What do I get in return? I get this. I get lies. I get death. <laughs> 